Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I just wanted to do a quick monthly setup with me, I guess, or plan with me kind of thing. There's not too much plans wise that I guess is needed to get, you know, like talked about or recorded, but I did want to show you the really, really pretty um, design that Planner Kate from Etsy has released for the month of August. It's so cute. I loved it. I'm not a huge yellow person. I guess I like the yellow, like the one on the tabs here. It's like a darker yellow than the than the pale yellow here. So that's part of why I wanted to make sure to see what she came out with and she did not disappoint. I do exclusively use Planner Kate. I don't think I've... Yeah, I haven't tried any other ones with my Erin Condren Life Planner. This is my first year doing this sort of thing. It's 2019 and I had started in March. So now we're in August. So I am about five months in, almost five months in. So I just wanted to show you really quick what I had gotten. And with every Planner Kate order on Etsy, you get this really cute little business card that has a code on the back that seems to always be usable. Thank you so much, 15. I do also use Sarah Marie from YouTube had mentioned in a couple of her videos, um, Happy Place 20 for 20% off. And that one did work the last time I put in order, which was this last week. So we also get a script sticker that I like to use on my binder. If you've ever seen one of my videos, this is how it looks. So I put one here on the top and then here on the side. And these really cute little binders I got from Target. They were like $1.50 each on sale. And then you get five free little sticker like freebies. So this time I got a new one. This is a new one. It seems to have just in script a lot of different chores or little self-care duties or self-care events. And then you get these cute little script stickers for your socials or for appointments, or for school, or housework, or TV show stuff. Um, even Amazon, that's really cute. And then we got another one kind of like that, but a, less, a lesser amount of these, and including these lined ones that you can put like the sticker on top of. It's really windy outside. And then I got two of this little polka dot, like it reminds me kind of of the 50s style of uh, box stickers and these glitter stickers that I've never used actually. I give my little sister all of my um, all of my sampler stickers because it makes her happy and it makes me happy to be able to give away. And then of course any of my regular orders that if she would want them she would of course have them too. So okay on to the main event. The, the the quote for this month in Erin Condren, and if you put any orders throughout August, you get a little postcard with the same color and is an, uh, logo, I mean, a uh, quote on it. It is, forget the mistakes, remember the lessons. I really like that. And this is how it looks. So you can see here, I did do some advanced planning in terms of exam prep. However, this is not set in stone, and I'm likely going to push it back until September, just because I want to... I want to get it right. I want to get 110% prepared, which I know you can with the CPA exam, but I want to have time to review multiple questions, multiple choice questions as much as possible. So that's what I mean by that, because you're never going to be prepared for what you can get on the test because it changes every time. I also have a race coming up, a 5K that I've, the last time I ran, according to my Nike app, the, the total miles for a 5K was September 16th of last year 2018 so that's probably going to be a lot of walking and a lot of jogging and then here i put some priorities which is the foreign cpa and then budgeting mainly for our family trip as well as youtube because i want to be consistent with my videos oh and i have a hair appointment on the 31st so the big reveal these are the stickers for the month of august that planner kate has made and they are a really pretty yellow and pink and floral combination. The floral with a background of stripes, which just for me, which just, excuse me, for me, screams summer. I got the regular 7x9 sticker set and then the deluxe monthly 8.5x11 sticker set. So I'm going to be taking this one with me to work. 
I just wanted to show you how it looked on both. The quality does not go away with the 8.5 by 11. It is definitely still there. And this is my first sticker set I actually bought in for the Deluxe Monthly. So I'm really excited to put that one in. Just so when I go in and I put like all the monthly meetings I have or appointments, it just it's pretty to look at. So the Deluxe Monthly, if you don't know, is for Erin Condren exactly like this, but in the 8.5 by 11 version. So this is the one I got also for the seven and a half, I'm sorry, seven by nine <laughs> planner. And I'm just so excited to see how it looks. I'm a huge person when it comes to, these aren't cheap, they're $5 each, which is $10 for two sticker sheets, which sounds probably a bit much for many, but to invest in this planner to begin with is expensive. And if I'm gonna be, I guess, using something like this on the daily, I might as well make it in my in my budget range as cute as possible. I don't buy these stickers all the time because that I can't do, but overall it's just it's it's so worth it. So I just grabbed this one first because it's the one that has the date the the month name on it. And I'm going to go ahead and put that one down. This I have to be careful with because I'm not good at putting down stickers. I'm very much an amateur at it. And I don't want to mess up by having to put it down more than once. Okay. So here I put it a little crooked. I don't know if you could... No, you can't see, but... That works. Yay, it looks so pretty already. And then over here... We'll go this side down. I don't know why my focus is not working. As well as it usually does. Usually it's a really easy focus, and I don't want to, there we go. I don't want to spend too much time with it up in the air and not on the page. Ooh, this one went down really good. Perfect. Ooh, there we go. Okay, so that's how that's going to look. I love it already. I think it. I just it's really interesting how these stickers can totally change the page look because instead of having the plain block of color now this this design just adds more to it it's super pretty I also have is it one or two? Oh, it's two yeah I have two thin sheets strips of washi I'm not sure what to do with these though hmm mm, how do I do it for June I think I put it at the top Oh, this one was different. It was one thick sheet. So I guess this is also meant to be like a thick one, but it's really just two lines. Let me think about this really quick. I think I'm gonna go ahead and put it I think I'm gonna put it at the very bottom. Yeah, on this side, I'll put it on the very bottom for sure. That's what I'll do. No, see, I, I, I'm not good with putting these things down. So I'm covering up a bit of September's little month box there, so I wanna take that off. There we go. Yeah, I like how that looks. That looks really cute. Um, probably gonna be moving this sticker soon, so I don't wanna use, I guess, cause these are removable. I don't wanna remove these too much cause then they won't stick down well, but for the sake of my little washi on the bottom, I'll go ahead and move this one just a little bit higher. There we go. And studying's been going pretty decently so far. Um, again, we'll see how it goes timing-wise as, as for when I sit for this one. But I'm definitely gonna do it before October because that's when work's gonna get crazy busy again. And I think I'll put 
yeah I'll put like the remnants on this side because these are the month the days of July and since this is August no need for those No, it's crooked. Oh, no, it's not. Perfect. Oh, and will these fit? Uh, kinda. I'll just do that. There we go. Yeah, that looks kinda awkward. Hmm. Oh, maybe I'll do a... I could do a cover-up. Erin Condren's planner paper quality is really good, it's really thick, but if you indent it too much, like I just did, it'll definitely show. I'm gonna go ahead and try and use it up to cover this little area here. That could work. And what I'm doing here, I'm 110% going to do also for my Deluxe Monthly, so I won't be recording that just to avoid a double, a double of the same thing. Yeah, that'll work. And then I'll just keep that for the trash. My legs are falling asleep. Okay. So what else? What else? What else? I love these little circle stickers, they're super cute. And I like that these build dues are here too. I love the day offs. I'm trying to think. I think I'll do one orange and one yellow for payday. When's payday again? I get paid the 26th next. So not the second, but the ninth. Put that there. Oops, that's crooked. Oh well. And then I'll also do yellow for the 23rd. Oh, actually, no, because the orange matches the October orange. And I'm almost definitely going to get a monthly sticker for October as well, but it'll match the tab, so I think I'll save that one for then. Actually, I'll put it here just because I don't want to get it on the white paper part and then it'll mess up the stickiness. As dumb as that sounds. It'll probably happen. There we go. So I have my tuition due on the 26th. But when I very likely move all this stuff, I'll just do that then. Then. So for now, I'll do my my other two main bills on the 2nd and on the 10th. And then, oh, see, this one's already falling off. I don't know when I'm doing days off. Again, it depends on when I move this. So I'll leave that there. And then I'll go ahead and put down all of the little squares. In the meantime, so I really want to soon do another CPA study with me not like the real-time one where it's more quiet and you're following along while I'm doing it but mm, like kind of a sit-down thing where I'm talking to you guys but I'm not studying it's kind of like an update of my system how that's going for me biggest thing is just patience especially if you're working full-time because you have less time during the day and then of course you waste all your energy on work the rest throughout the day from your 8 to 5 time Monday through Friday it it can get really easy to not commit 
That payday sticker. I might as well just put it on in October, huh? So I get paid not the 30th, but the 6th, the 20th, so October 4th would be my first payday in that month. There we go. So that'll take care of it not being on the sticker set properly. And then, yeah, I'm probably going to move these for... For sticker sets, I already mentioned in my plan with me for the week this is getting uploaded, the week of the 22nd of July, Planner Kate's having her anniversary sale. And from my understanding, it was 40% off last year, so I'm bulking up my Etsy save for later with like, I think I have like 12 or 13 sticker sets ordered, I mean sticker pages ordered in there already. And a lot of it's the full and half boxes as well as the thin and thick washi because I'm thinking I'm leaning a lot more towards next year moving from the life planner to a bullet journal and still incorporating all the stickers I have from planner Kate into that bullet journal it'll be a lot more of a creative like release I guess and that's a big part of why I love the sticker so much is because you get to creatively without um, I guess drawing everything yourself you know you get to have that outlet of oh let me make this look a certain way or how do I design it and it's also very flexible because based on what you're looking for in a planner in this case I want something smaller not as like I guess bulky because I mean I'm not like I want to say a majority of the Erin Condren users are moms or they use it in a different way than myself that gets to utilize way more than I feel like I'm using utilizing it and I like the system my mom now though so it's not a matter of I guess making it more just filled up because I'm simply not writing stuff down all the time if that makes any sense plus it's also $60 for a planner which I don't feel like I'm ready to commit to. I got this planner for like half off. And I actually got the life planner f um, covered because I had unintentionally bought the deluxe thinking it was like the life planner but bigger, which was a mistake. And Erin Condren's customer service was amazing. I'm 110% going to still use them because I love, love, love their notebooks for studying. And I do recommend them to, you know, like anyone who, oh, I'll use these to cover the dates. Um, I recommend it to anyone who's looking, but it's just not, I don't think, as of now, going to work out for me next year. So, yes, still using Planner Key. Planner-wise, I'm not going to be using Erin Condren, most likely. I want to show you my dog because he's sitting right next to me and he's fell asleep and it's really cute. I'm using a yoga mat because I'm on our carpet and I have the little tripod that's flexible like tied up to this table so you can get the aerial view without like a weird angle and it's just really cute. So I'm going to show you him right now because that is it. That is my August layout for my Erin Condren Life Planner. Super, super satisfied, as usual, with Planner Kate. She does an awesome job. And you can see here the blue polka dot. It's just perfect summer look. I love the idea of summer, even though it's so, so hot. I just like the idea of, you know, having more time if you're not working all the time. And then it's the summer. In terms of sunniness and walking outside without freezing your butt off but at the same time you can have like barbecues and all that we don't we don't have a grill or anything but I just like the idea of that so it makes me very happy that this planner kind of shows that creatively and yeah we're already almost there that's crazy we're on the last week almost of June July I mean before we know it we'll be ready to go starting tomorrow almost the end so that'll be all for today. Thank you all so much for watching. 
I really appreciate the, the support on these videos. Please do subscribe to this channel to help support me with future videos like this one. And until next time, I'll see you soon. Bye, everyone. I want to show you my dog really quick. Say hi. Bye, you guys.